What's up, everyone? Haha, -ha, Mark Lobliner, TigerFitness.com. Rocking it. Got my peanut butter MTS Way, peanut butter fluff, and macro lotion on deck. Sludge, check it out, man. It's from my man, I'm gonna leave his name out, Gyno Past Puberty Reversal. Mark, I'm a drug-free lifter and had gyno since last year. I got it at 19. Anyway, my doctor was doesn't want to prescribe me anything. I asked for raloxifen slash tamoxifen. Okay, tamoxifen is Novadex, for those of you who are more familiar with that word. But that merely prevents, it doesn't reverse. As you have a little bit more expertise regarding drugs, how'd you know? What does reverse gyno? I basically got it out of the blue serious. I got, oh look. My left nipple, since I competed as a fucking 150-pound lightweight, I've been getting accused of having fucking gyno and being on steroids when I was fucking 150 pounds. If I was on steroids at 150 pounds, my shit was fake. All right? It was... I was 150 pounds! Um, what can you do to reverse gyno? Um, but my parents are not going to pay 2,500 euros for minor insecurities. Thanks in advance and, um, and all that. Here, here's the deal. There's only one way to get rid of gyno in that surgery. I know it sucks. It might alleviate it a little if you take certain things like uh, aromasin or shit like that. It might alleviate it a little due to the estrogen receptors, whatever. At the end of the day, it's a gland. Once you get that gland taken out, you cannot get gyno again. So what they do, there's two ways to do it. They can either suck the fat out of your nipple, which is a temporary fix, because if you're sensitive there, it will come back, or you get complete gland removal. Now, what I recend is getting the gland removed. I believe it's somewhere around five to seven thousand dollars last time I checked, probably less, but I wouldn't skimp on a surgery involving my nipples or anything else where they're cutting shit out of your body. So what I would do, if you have gyno, it's a big part of your body. You know, mine's not bad enough on my left nipple to really save up, not really save up. I can go have it now. But I'm not really, it's not really bothering me. However, at some point in my life, I might want to get rid of that. And when I do, I'm going to just get both glands fucking taken out. They cut it out. They stitch it up. Boom, you're gyno free. Most IFBB pros have it done. Most bodybuilders have it done. And the ones without gyno are the ones who have had it done usually. Um, myself, you know, my right nipple's fine. It's always been there. You can look at picture of me of a fat kid. I can post one if I remember. And at the end of the day... You know, I've always had that nipple um, since I was, I believe, 15. Now, when I was a kid, I had extremely high testosterone for a teenager. So what happened is everything went crazy. I had bad acne. Um, I had temper issues. I had fucking gyno develop. Um, it, it was crazy. But I understand I have it. And the bottom line is everybody claims this will help reduce gyno. This, no, it won't. Just shut the fuck up. If you have gyno, you got to get surgery. It, it is what it is. If you have gyno, the only way to fucking reverse it is to get it taken out. You might be able to alleviate some of the tenderness and a little bit of puffiness. At the end of the day, the gyno is going to be there. If you have it, save up and get it cut the fuck out. Sorry. Wish I had a better answer for you. I get this email at least twice a week. And I just want to say my final verdict on gyno is if you fucking have it, get it taken out. Now, if you're prone to gyno and you are on extracurricular drugs like testosterone or any of the other stuff, be sure to take precautions and take a Remedex with it and stuff like that to help prevent it. At the end of the day, you still might get it. You still might have it. A lot of teenagers get it. A lot of people just aren't lean enough to see it. The amount of dudes go to the beach. Everybody has fucking bitch tits. They're just fat. You can't tell if they're fat or they have fucking gyno. When you're at 5% body fat like me, yeah, you're going to fucking show your gyno. It is what it is. So what I do is I just use it to my advantage to have big breasts. I lift it up and I lick my own titty. I'm Mark Lobliner, TigerFitness.com. Because licking your own titty for sexual stimulation, that's not a game.